Jameson Williams is back, and this is crazy. So we're going to look at when can he play, when can he practice, Is he, is he can he actually play this week, and this story is crazier than it first appears for a couple of reasons. So if you haven't heard by now, Jameson Williams reinstated by the NFL. This is just crazy that this happens. I mean, <laughs> the Lions and the fan base riding high already um, with the victory over the Green Bay Packers and now Jamison Williams coming back because really against the Packers, the one weakness that you saw or just, you're like, you know, it'd be nice if we had a vertical threat. It's kind of the only thing we're missing, just the threat, right? We don't have to throw it deep every time. We just need a threat to back everybody off. Well, here he comes, Jamison Williams. So the league is reinstating these two players because here's the adjustment that they made to the rule right in right in the middle of the suspension i love this by the nfl it's not often that the nfl makes the right no not not the nfl just any big entity they make a decision and it's like well i'm sorry we kind of messed up or whatever because remember jameson williams was originally suspended because he bet on other sports at the facility he's at the facility betting on you know college baseball and it's like yep suspended it's like no come on that seems odd and then you're like well you know what jameson williams you shouldn't be doing that but here's the here's what's going on they made an adjustment said hey if you bet on nfl games like don't do that just don't so in general like don't even bet we all get that but do not bet on nfl games that's when you're just gonna be screwed but if you place bets on other sports while at the workplace or working we're gonna re reduce that that i mean okay don't do it slap on the wrist type stuff and so to actually make that change during his suspension is so crazy so the nfl and the nfl players association share a long-standing unwavering commitment to protect the integrity of the game so remember the nfl is saying don't do it nfl pa is saying hey i get we don't shouldn't do it but i mean it's, he was betting on something that wasn't on the NFL. So what does this mean? It means that for the first time, offenders, six game bans, also without second and suspension without pay. So the miss, the most significant change outside the NFL arena reduces penalties for betting other on other sports while in the workplace, calling for two game suspensions without pay for the first time offenders and six game bans for second time offenders. Well, Jameson Williams, the first time offender and he's already, he's already paid his, penalties he's out for four games so he's back so he's back it's just like it's all gone he's back and ready to roll that means this is absolutely crazy the nfl just looks at it says you know what our bad we kind of looked at this we're gonna make some changes i appreciate that and i love that they did that change they haven't made a, a change to a rule while someone was being impacted by that rule ever right it's just like whoops We'll look at that later and figure it out. This is right as it's happening in live time. They make the change. Just crazy. No one expected it. We heard rumors, but it's like, well, they're not going to change the rule. He's already, that's already what it was. And he's, and he's done. So what does this mean? Jameson Williams can come back this week against Carolina at home. Why is it significant? Obviously you get Jameson Williams, but it's significant because we've already played. So it's Friday. We're going to get this weekend. It's not like because it's like, well, then Sunday. No, he is ready for the next game. I don't see why he would not be ready for the next game. Hopefully, Jameson Williams has been staying ready and not like, well, I'll just get ready when I get back. Let's hope he's playing, you know, been practicing or but just been working out and he's in shape and we should see him a little bit next week. Now, is he going to play a ton? I don't think he will. That's fine. But let's get him in now. Play a couple weeks by week and then he is just full go for the rest of the season and we've got the vertical threat that's the only thing on this team that we're missing is the threat of going deep push the safeties back now amon ra and laporta underneath over the middle that's what goff loves that's what he's so good at but you saw it against the packers the safeties were hammering down they were baiting goff they wanted to to double Amon Ra. The, the safeties are just playing so down on us that it's so difficult. So let me know your thoughts in the comments on this. I think it's a great, great news and just awesome as the this week just keeps getting better and better. And we'll see all of you on the